righty. Uh, oh. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another YouTube video. I'm your host, The Ghost. Today, guys, we are back in Vampire. I believe I have, like, maybe two or three more videos to, to make on this because I, I believe we're coming close to the end of our little vampire storyline. So, uh, we're back in the Ascalon Club. And, uh, yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> it's really, I, I have not much words to say for the Ascalon Club for the fact that I personally don't like them. I, I, I know a lot of people are going to be like, I mean, probably like two people that watch these videos, but like, they're going to be like, Ghost, they're vampires. They're the London elite. Why don't you like them? I just, I, it's something, it's, it's just something about the leader guy that I just don't like. And if it comes down to it, I would like to uh, destroy it. <laughs> Question mark. So, uh, we're, uh, questioning the locals about the infection. We've already questioned Charlotte. Report the equality between men and women. Is this a new guy? Oh, he's got a mic. Good evening, old chap. I won't lie. Oh, I, you need I talked some rest, to Clarence. Clarence. You should try to sleep. That's cinematic feel. <laughs> Can I knock on this door? Anybody new down here? I haven't told. Ooh, okay. Hello. Oh, is anyone there? Oh. Jonathan, is that you? I did not know you were back in London. Oh, my dear Johnny, I am so sorry for your loss. Mary was such a sweetheart. Thank you, Venus. Venus. I, I was going to bed actually. Let me in! I'm sure you can spare me a few minutes. For old time's sake. Of course you may enter. Dude, that's so crappy. The fucking seduction ability, like, to just take advantage of anybody. And oh my god, Jonathan. Oh wow. Jonathan, you've seen better days, my dude. It's a pleasure to see you again, Venus. So you returned from the war in one piece, too. Thank god. My Clarence is back home, too. How is the old rascal? Probably outside, chasing ghosts and chimeras. Clarence has changed a lot since he returned from the war, you know. Yeah, Clarence, he's seen the vampires during the war. I'm investigating the source of the That's epidemic right. in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual? The McPhersons. I heard they locked themselves in their own house. They could just be afraid of getting sick. Perhaps you're right. But if I were you, I'd pay them a visit. A big house, reachable through a courtyard, to the north of the railway bridge. I think I've already been there in the last episode. Goodbye, I think I killed the sister? You know they were always oh, no. here. But at this point, <laughs> Ravage their house gather as much goodies as I can and then make off like a bandit. Personally, if I was if I was the person that owned this house, I wouldn't let just a random stranger run around and take whatever they want from any drawer and any nook or cranny. Look, I'm taking Venus's journal. Like, I am invading their privacy, but yet nobody says anything about that. Gotta love video games. Uh, I was like, where is the ability to vanish? Gotta love video games! <laughs> oh, I thought that actually did. I, I had a, like, a pit in my stomach because I was, I was falling. Oh, it spooked me bottle of alcohol. I can't use my vanish ability in here, so... Okay. Is 
so apparently I haven't been here yet. This is a new person, a new door that I can knock on now. No. No. Let's see here. Check the map real quick. Find the source of the infection. Merchant. Okay, so. We're going this way. Poor Clarence. I'm going to help him out when I get some medicine. Women die too in this so is this the right place? This is the merchant, I believe. Yep. And we'll go... This way, the court door, courtyard. I cannot enter. Ooh, that's <laughs> okay. Well, I'm guessing that's probably why I can't enter. There's well, there's a dead body here. Let's go around. It's the vomitors. Surprise! <laughs> Oh god, no, no! <laughs> it's a big one! Suffocating, I didn't even notice. Oh my god. This is a predicament. 16. Alright. You guys are just gonna have to let me run away. Fuck you. Fuck you! <laughs> okay, I can't go that way. Fuck a duck. Oh! Follow me through the blood mist, bitches. Alright. The Ascalon Club has all these goddamn vampires on their side, but yet they're too much of a pussy to come down here and deal with this. Alright. You've killed me twice. Nice flowers. 
Ooh. Remarkable pump action shotgun. We might have to test that out. Not right now, though. Opium. Yes, buddy. But I am here. Fuck it. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and up. Oh my god, never mind. Fuck a duck. <laughs> there has to be a way out. <laughs> it's such a shitty situation. Ugh. I could probably use all the guns. I, I fucked up with the old uh, going down here. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna go with the same mentality. This does a lot of damage. Fucked up! Alright. So this is where we're gonna flip out. We're gonna try a different method. method. We're... Oh, well. We only got one gun. Ah! Alright, it looks like the little fuck you clouds isn't working so we're gonna go back into attack speed this uses less stamina though Oh god! Oh god, don't! God damn it, I can't... No! Fuck! I'm fucking... Fucking shit! I guess we can 
didn't sleep because really I didn't sleep in the last episode so I, I would like to evolve a bit get a little bit stronger pretty fucking good. Okay, well. My blood capacity. Do I need to upgrade that? Um. We'll upgrade it twice. And our stamina. Oh, thank God. We need we need better stamina. <laughs> oh, we're short a bit. We're gonna probably work on our body condition as well. Yeah. We're just we're gonna get all the stuff that keeps us alive. <laughs> that seems to be the best thing. Rage. Rage doesn't really have a cost, but it you will lose control. Let the beast take over in a short period of time. The beast teleports itself to all enemies around you and stalks them. The furious blows. Okay. Is that the uh, the Volca Volcahar vampires become that? Uh, we went with more of a shadowy kind of character, which I'm not entirely, like, this dismissing I like the idea of having the power to vanish and s uh, we're probably gonna need a little bit more blood spring ammo bag probably be good medical bag all right well that's what we got for right now Oh, the following night. Who's ill? Is there only one person here? Hey. Hey, we're doing pretty good. <laughs> this is not a this is not a good situation to be in. <laughs> this is still in stable condition. I thought I gave everybody the the treatments in the last few episodes. I guess I didn't. Okay, the docks. Oh, missing, missing, missing. I killed him. Um, okay. The docks are in a really shitty situation. <laughs> Surprise, motherfuckers! on my blood right there. Alright. That's done. Let's let's fold over to our butter knife. I, you were not even fucking close to me. What's going on here, man? I hate that fucking ability so much. Nullify 
fight it. Stay, bitch. Got her. All right. Yeah, he's more savage. Play this like a smart fucker. All right, ghost. Don't he he's stronger than you. Remember that. Okay. Okay. I got this. I got this. Woo! I'm I'm spooky. I'm I'm a spooky. If I can get those little You were even fucking close to me. Got him! Holy shit, this was a fight. Holy fuck. Like, you guys don't know how fucking hard that was. I, I've... In the, the five seconds that you saw me edit this. Oh, fuck. It's locked. No shit. It's always locked. Lead pipe any day. I'd head back if I were you, sir. Fuck off. No, that's not. Please, sir, can't let you get this weapons ready. No, no, I didn't want to fight. I'm serious. A fucking. I'm trying to do an investigation. I, I. You guys picked the fight with me. May your God protect you from the onslaught of my fist going to your face. Faced. Sound cooler in my head. <laughs> cool. All right. Fuck vampire laws. I don't need to be invited in. I'll just sneak in. <laughs> oh boy. It only took me like four hours to kill off those that couple. When my makeshift gear. All right. So. Have a heartbeat down here. Woe to you, nations of the night. Ooh. For in front of you stands the tall queen. Oh, this is a boss you battle. Can, but lower your head. can that be Doris Fletcher's voice? Where does it come from? Got rats. Always got rats somewhere in this city. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I don't got time for you. I totally do not remember them ever exploding. And every time I, I'm like, oh, I'm standing right in the. Pre Words. I know words, okay? I'm burning. 
Shake it off. Shake it off. This is a boss but fight. You burn and die, she will rise and be queen again. Please don't let this be a boss fight. I don't think I can handle it. <laughs> These are all of her bills. She's she's secretly bankrupt. <laughs> I know that feeling. Not having enough coin. We probably might want to get this fixed up, Doris. I like the violin in the background, that's nice. Same thing over again. I thought she was pointing straight at me. I was like, holy shit. Alright. Woe to you as well, Doris. Okay, so I was on the right track. I love how Jonathan, Jonathan has the con- oh, right. This is despicable. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, this is a boss fight. Who are you? You who dared enter my realm. Are you here to worship or mock me? I'm here to put an end to the vampire epidemic, Miss Fletcher. Ah. But Doris Fletcher is no more. Yeah, this is a boss she fight. She was consumed by this putrid flesh that now enshrouds her. You feel anger for what happened to you. But I can help you. I'm a doctor, Miss Fletcher. Doris Fletcher is no more. Can All I convince her? Remains are the dreams of the queen she was, and the queen she'll be. Until then, all shall die. For that was her final oh. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Can you not fight me like a normal fucking person? You gotta have your little fucking dockies come over here and fight with you? I don't know, I mean... Fucking get rid of this piece of shit. Your blood will be my Woo! She nicked me. No, don't don't do that. Oh my god, fuck you! Fuck you! So that's what you get- that's- uh, If I 
wanted to play Dark Souls, I would be playing Dark Souls. Please like shut the fuck up. Save your queen. Behold, can plan the disgrace of she. Oh, she's got an arm. She's got a. Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh shit! Calm down, prototype. I love how all the furniture in this area is no more. Fuck a dock. Your blood will. Oh god, my stamina. I just want to heal. idea of me being the dark prince and all but lady calm the fuck down i'm a goddamn doctor oh my god lady calm the fuck down i'm a doctor I love the blood vortex now. I understand what it does. While it's thrown up, I can gain blood from it. Oh, God, I missed. Got her. Oh, my God. Uh, wait. I beg you, wait. What? I, I don't want to die. And I did not come to kill you. Will you spare me then? Save this cadaverous carcass of mine. Does your heart beat a little faster now? You fancy me then, Doctor? No, Miss Fletcher. My dead heart will beat for only one. Ah! Is she pretty? Is she sweet and tender? To me, yes. Ah! I hate her already. I know. And this is partly why you must be destroyed. But you just said... That I did not come here to kill you, yes. But I realize now the threat you embody must be stopped. <sighs> that fucking arm. Will I be remembered? Will you? You were Doris Fletcher. The greatest actress of her generation. No one can take that from you. Thank you. And farewell. Oh god. It's Dark Souls all over again. Praise the sun! I'm sorry, Blood. Farewell, Doris. 
<sighs> I'm glad I got her on the first go. Damn, dude. Two boss fights in the Bravo! same. So dramatic. Same episode. I love it. Oh. McCullum. How strange I seem to find you whenever I'm inquiring about that scal infestation. I mean you no harm. I'm not here for you. But once I've put all the pieces of the puzzle together, I'm sure we'll have a little chat, you and me. Stay away from me, McCullum. You and all your war dogs. That I can't guarantee, Dr. Reed. But I'll let you go. For now. I'll let you go for now. <laughs> I should probably leave the theater right now. I cannot enter. The West End should be safe now. But London is not. It would be wise to benefit from the Ascalon's protection while I continue my research doing the greater. Yeah. Holy shit, guys. Elizabeth, what are you doing here? I've been formally asked to witness your triumph, my dear. After all, isn't it the natural role of a woman to support her man in victory? But it's you who insisted I join the Ascalon. Please forgive my giddiness. I'm just overcome by the thrill of finally being allowed within these hallowed halls. You certainly have an inquisitive mind. <laughs> Elizabeth Ashbury, only you can make me smile in these difficult times. And the same to you, Jonathan Reed. Now go have your little chat with the chairman. I can see he's practically bursting to hear your report. I, I sense something. I know something's going on. <laughs> oh, we got a we got a new weapon. It's worse than. It's actually faster than my handmade saw. I might actually work on that, make it a little bit better. Oh, but they're not in their typical rooms. Lord Redgrave is outside almost every night coordinating our defenses. Oh, he's outside. Who's this? Always a pleasure to see oh, okay. you. Okay, they're not. They're not willing to talk to me, so I don't know anything about them. says he's in here I don't know like I'm just going in and out of the Ascalon club for no reason I'm just not looking for the right areas the situation <laughs> I'm actually quite happy I've made it this far with such such rudimentary gear I've acquired fucking scalpel and a handsaw we repelled the Lord, Lord Redgrave? Yes, okay, there we go. Welcome are. back to the Ascalon Club, Lance Bearer. Please, tell us the good news. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. She was probably the first to be infected. And you cleansed her before the hunters, I've been told. Well done, Dr. Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. I did my best. I'm just a doctor. <laughs> I'm just a doctor. The important thing is we won a major battle for the survival of London. For that, we salute you. Thank you, my lord. Now, I have another task for you. One of the utmost importance. Perhaps even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. 
I want you to recruit a new vampire. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dawson the Ekon he deserves to be. Oh. As you wish. I can't! I'm Fuck sorry, no! But I can't. Are you questioning my orders? No. It's just... I'm not sure I'm ready to have another progeny after what happened with my sister. The rebirth of Aloysius Dawson is a necessary step in our campaign to ensure the safety of London. Uh, it's so How fucked would you up. like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. Your word is my command. Ah, I don't get a choice. Your word is my command. Ah, oh, I don't get a choice. God damn it. Well then, guys. I hope you enjoyed this commentary. If you did, please lick that like button. Subscribe for more of this lovely content. Until next time, guys. Vos Nodonia. And I'm going to cue that outro. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!